October is World Blindness Awareness Month, and glaucoma is the leading cause of blindness in the U.S. ABC 36 News anchor and health reporter Christy Runyon has a look at a new treatment that's helping glaucoma patients see clearer sooner. The University of Kentucky is the only medical facility in the state to offer a new glaucoma procedure, and one patient is the perfect judge of traditional treatments versus the new option. I'm just going to put those drops in the usual ones to check the pressure for you, okay? Glaucoma changed Joyce Underwood's vision. I had uh, spots in my eyes. In glaucoma, what happens is that this nerve gets damaged. And when this nerve gets damaged, you start losing vision. That damage is caused by increasing pressure from fluid that isn't draining properly from channels in the eye. A minimally invasive procedure with a device called trabectome gives doctors a new way to treat the disease without large incisions or tubes placed in the eye. What this instrument does is to very gently remove the tissue which is blocking those channels. Joyce Underwood had traditional glaucoma surgery in her left eye, but was treated using the trabectome procedure in her right the, eye. Uh, the new one uh, procedure was a whole lot quicker in healing up, and I can see good. The recovery period with this is extremely quick. Actually, within a day or two, patients can be back to their work. The procedure itself also takes less time, has fewer complications, and can be performed with only topical anesthesia, eye drops to numb the eye. It's actually the tip of this handpiece that enters the eye. Uh, we make a very tiny keyhole opening, which is about 1.6 millimeter size on the side of an eye. It's a tiny incision and about a 30-minute procedure that's made a big difference for patients like Joyce Underwood. I can read books better now. In uh, the television, I can see the finer print that I wasn't able to before. Glaucoma can cause irreversible damage to the eye, so catching it early is key, and patients with more advanced stages may still not be suitable for this treatment. To learn more about glaucoma and trabectome, visit the health section of WTVQ.com.